investigate the contract for the modification of the Escravos gas plant EGB-3B production platform following the joint venture agreement between the Nigerian National Petroleum Company, NNPC, and Chevron Nigeria Limited. I so move. I rise to second the first leg of the motion that the matter is urgent. Very urgent. I wish you set aside every impediment and go ahead to take it today. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, my distinguished colleagues. Those in favor of the motion say aye. Those against say nay. The ayes have it. Honorable Dili Doye, move your motion. The House notes that Nigeria is a country blessed with several natural resources, including crude oil, natural gas, and other minerals. And in its efforts to maximize value, the government of the Federation, through the NNPC, entered into various service agreements with international oil companies. It also notes that the EGP, Escravos Gas to Plant 3B production platform, is a project designed to gather associated gas from nine production platforms, of which seven are in the north offshore area and two are in the south offshore area. The north offshore area fields are Itsan production platform, Erwan production area, Paraba production platform, Malu production platform, and Opolo production platform. Marine 1 production platform and Marine 2 production platform. While those in the south offshore area fields are Delta production platform and Tapa production platform. The House is aware that the NNPC is in a joint venture agreement with Chevron Nigeria Limited, CNL, and informed that the joint venture agreement between NNPC and the Chevron Nigeria Limited agreed to modify EGP-3B production platform, and the contract was awarded to Prime Source Limited. As a major contractor, and at the initial cost of a ceiling of 61, 179, and 198 million dollars. However, there was an agreement across board that Prime Source Limited, PSL, could no longer execute the contract for the original quoted amount and the amount was raised from, 100 and, from 68 to 114, 580, 800 million dollars. Further informed that in the course of engagement and executing, there were several delays and avoidable challenges encountered by the contractor Hence, various variation claims and change orders were made, some of which did not get the approval of NNPC and or NAPIMS. But monies have since been paid out to that effect. Concerned that there may not have been a value for money audit of the above mentioned project and identity of the contractors their findings and the actions taken by the NNPC stroke nappings based on the recommendation, if any, needs to be ascertained. Further consent that given the oil and gas industry as a huge source of revenue to Nigeria, it is essential that as legislators, we should strive to ensure that what the government intends to spend and what it actually spends and what it achieves from the spending is beneficial and profitable to the country and the generality of Nigerians. Accordingly, the House resolves to mandate 
the House Committee on Gas Resources to investigate the contract for the upgrade of the EGV-3B production platform ranging from project governance, costs and financials to the project's performance and its benchmark and report back to the House within four months. I so move. Those in favor of the motion say aye. aye. Those against say nay. The highs average. <laughs>